Okay, ladies, so I am super duper excited to do this review, which is gonna be a very involved and thorough review of the LA Girls lip paints that came out like last week or the week before. And if you follow me on Instagram at Lisa Alamode, you know that I, as soon as I got these in the mail, I did a quick swatch on my hand and took a picture for you. And I was like, yo, I, like, I'm super, super pumped. I first was alerted to these through, I think Nouveau Cheap posted on Instagram that they were gonna be coming out um, and that they were potential dupes for, which I have as well, the Too Faced Melted Liquefied Longwear Lipsticks. And so this is gonna be a review of not only these lip glazes, which are amazing, but then also a comparison to different alternatives to, you know, to other lip products that are out there that people may think these are dupes for, which ones they're most like. For instance, the Too Faced Melted, the um, the Lip Tars, which are in that family, and of course, the Rimmel London Show Off Lip Lacquers as well. So. Um, the, these lip paints have things in common with all of these and I just want you when you're making a decision to really know and I get the biggest one of course is going to be whether or not it's really a dupe for the melted um, Too Faced melted longwear liquid lipsticks. So um, keep watching if you want to see this review. I know you want to see this review so keep watching. So okay. 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 I'm so excited. I've never been more excited to do a review for you. Okay. Ready, ready. All right, so, okay. So the melted liquid lip paints, the, the glazed, LA Girl glazed lip paints, okay? So I'm gonna do swatches, of course, for all of these. So let's just start with a quick review about this product. So these retail on the LA Girl's website for $4.99. That's where I purchased these. These are not given to me. I purchased them with my own cash money, okay? So um, that's where I purchased them. And I think you get free shipping if you spend 25 bucks. So I think I had, I bought like one of the LA Girl Pro concealers to make it $25 after I bought all of these. Now there are six colors and your girl has, a res yeah, there are six colors and your girl has all of them. So there are like three pink shades and then a purple shade and then a orange shade and a red. So I think they did a really good job with doing shades. They don't have like a kind of like a deeper pink, like a fuchsia color, which I think would be great. I think that if they wanted to do one more color, that would be the one to do. But otherwise, I think these are amazing, 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 amazing products. Now, how are they? The color that I'm wearing right now is called blushing that's the color it's called it's the it's the color i'm wearing right now and it's called blushing it's a gorgeous pink i've been wearing it now for probably around two two and a half hours so these are amazing okay these are full coverage lip colors okay they are not matte okay so let's not be confused are they this most gloss like they are they super duper duper glossy no but they are a glossy feel they're not at all sticky so these are lip lacquers okay let's be honest these are liquid lipsticks that's exactly what they are i don't know what they're they're claiming to be super intense color extra glossy finish i've had glossier so they're not extra glossy but they are a glossy finish they're not matte in any regards so let's not get it confused in that sense um, and they're supposed to be long wear, you know, they're supposed to, you know, be, you know, lip paint. So they're supposed to last quite a bit of time. All right. So let's talk about how long they last and all that. So they are full coverage. So the one thing for me is that I have two different colors and my top lip is super dark brown and my bottom lip is bright pink. So it's great to find a lip color that kind of like covers all of that. So if you want to use a lip gloss, a lip liner to blend in and all that stuff, you can. But I hate using lip liners to be honest. I mean, I'll, I I have to do it with some colors, like a nude lip. You got to throw in a lip liner with some oranges. I have to use a lip liner as well because it kind of looks crazy. But um, so I may need to use lip liners with some of these. But for this color, I didn't have to. But I love that I just kind of put it on and it was you know right there. Here is the applicator on these, right here. If you can see, it's just like you know. An this is the applicator. I don't know how you describe it, but this is the applicator, okay? Um, which I like because it makes it easy to apply on the go. They do last a really long time. Like, I like that they're not sticky, and I like that they're not messy. As I talk to you, I probably have it on my teeth. 
but I like that they're not messy. Like, I feel like I'm not getting it all over my hands and my face and like, you know, you know what I mean? Like the way you might with an OCC lip tar, which are a little bit messy, that doesn't happen with these. I, I mean, that's, that's my review. They're not sticky, they're full coverage. They last for several, several hours. Um, probably around six hours I would say like if you're even if you're drinking something the other thing that I really like about these is that they fade beautifully like you know if you think of like the way matte lipsticks will fade like if you've ever had like a MAC lipstick or just a lipstick in general like when they fade that you might have like fading like in the middle of your lip and like the rest of the lip is like still stained with whatever color like weird these just kind of have that gradual fading effect so when it's time to reapply it's time to reapply but you still you might have a hint of color on your lip but it's okay the way you know it's not blotching at all and it doesn't so that's what I would say about these ladies I say go get them I say go get them in every goddamn color because it just I don't know where else I don't know where you can buy it on the ground I don't know where they because like where I see like I like you know some independent beauty supply stores you might see some LA girl pro concealers I saw in like some beauty supply stores in Brooklyn last weekend but other than that I don't know where you would get these so um ladies if you know where they may carry these in a store let me know who knows maybe I'll do a giveaway <laughs> so yeah so those that's my review of the LA girls um lip, lip paints let's go ahead and look at some of the swatches so again the color that I'm wearing right now is called blushing the next color that I'm going to show you is the color um, Baby Doll, and it's a super bright pink, Baby Doll Pink. Here it is. And the next color that I'm going to show you is the color um, Hot Mess, which is a gorgeous um, orange color that I would use um, probably a lip liner with to kind of make it blend a little bit better. The, the, the next color that I'm going to show you is Bombshell. Again, another gorgeous pink color, um, a different you know, version of pink, but still a beautiful pink color. So there are three pinks. Um, the next color that I'm going to show you is Pin Up, which is a really beautiful, beautiful red. It's not, it's, this is like a summer red. When I think of like a deeper blue based red, I think of maybe fall, maybe early spring, winter. This to me is like a straight up spring, summer red lip. So it's gorgeous. Um, and uh, last but not least is the color Koi, which is their purple color, which we're going to be doing some comparisons of this color with the LA Girl, with the Melted, Too Faced Melted, and the Lip Tars. So you can, you don't have to keep watching if you don't want to, but this is my review of the LA Girl's lip paints, and these are all my swatches. Of course, there'll be more swatches on um, www.lisaalamo.com with more detail review because I'm probably be forgetting things, right? But let's continue. For those of you that are interested in how these measure up to other lip products on the market let's go ahead and do some comparisons shall we so the first we're going to do is compare the lip um, paint the LA girl lip paints to the Too Faced melted liquefied long wear lipstick let us look at these side by side I mean they look like exact dupes by the bottle right by the way even the packaging is very very similar it's crazy and it's the same amount of products you get um, uh, 0.4 ounces in this and you get 0.4 ounces in the melted as well. The melted retails for $22 ladies and gentlemen. This retails for four. Hello! So great, 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 great. The packaging on the melted is is like this. The, the rather not the packaging but the um, the uh, the um, uh, Applicator. There we go. The applicator is is um kind of a it it's the same slanted whatever, but it has like that kind of like sponge on the end, which I don't know how that measures up with like bacteria. I feel like that could be a little bit germy, but it's a nice way to apply this product. Um, so let's compare them, right? Look, I'm gonna do a hand swatch of color comparisons for you, so you can kind of see in that sense which one if they are in fact dupes. The answer is no. <laughs> so the melted color in the color um, uh, melted violet. That's the color that this is here. The purple from from the melted line. It's called melted violet, and this is what it looks like. If you can see that, right? So that's the Too Faced. Now let's compare that to the LA Girls color, which is a color koi. And I'm gonna put that right above it. And as you can see, Koi is not nearly as pink. This is Koi here. This is the LA, sorry, this is the LA Girls um, color right here for you. Um, so as you can see, they're not dupes, okay? They're not dupes in terms of color um, here. They're definitely not dupes in terms of color. Um, in terms of quality, 
the LA Girls Glaze lip paints are glossier than the Melted. The Melted is not as glossy. Melted lasts longer on your lips because it's not as glossy, because it kind of is a little bit more of a stain, almost a little bit more of a stain. These just kind of fade off your lips, they, they slide off, they're, they're a wrap. So if we're gonna compare the two, let's be honest, and saying that they're not dupes, not only are they not dupes, now, Melted has several other colors. I think they also have six colors as well. So maybe in, there are other colors in the line. Maybe the Melted's orange is a dupe. Maybe one of the pinks in the in the Too Faced is a dupe. But we're, this is the only one I got because I was not trying to buy all five of the Melted to compare them to these because that, that would be crazy. That would be crazy. But they're both full coverage. N neither one is sheer. I'll put a, I'll put a um, quick, uh, you know, you can see really quickly what the Melted, Too Faced Melted looks like on me in the color melted violet so here you have it and again up next to the la girls lip glaze in the color koi they're not dupes in that in color at all or really even in in the full coverageness yes um in the in the feel of them pretty close one's glossy one's not as glossy okay so then, then let's compare these then to the obsessive compulsive um lip tars right now what is a dupe for the melted violet um two faced melted violet is in fact um upset occ lip tars in the color hoochie so this is actually a really really close dupe in fact i would i would act, i would argue and say now remember this is la girl this is um melted right now this is hoochie and as you can see hoochie and melted um the two face melted are really really close in color right um out of all of these the one that lasts the longest is the occ lip tar which runs retails for 18 dollars in the color hoochie this is the one that lasts the longest out of all of these it is the one that has the that really dries the most matte finish um still not super not drying and this one has also a bit of a stain um it's also messier to apply the, the you know the occ lip tar has this kind of um this uh applicator it's like whatever it comes with a little brush too but honestly i'm like the little brush once you use it you have to have something to clean it off with you can't just throw it in your purse the little you know what i mean it's too much work i really wish occ lip tar would, would get it together with an applicator that actually works so you can do on the go applications okay that little brush and eh, i threw those junks out they're great for kind of the first application but then what are you gonna do walk around with a brush all day that gets everywhere that's covered in lip gloss or lip whatever no my last comparison would be to um the rimmel show off lip lacquers the colors are all very different you know the limo rimmel doesn't have like an orange or whatever but these also retail for $4.99 they're a drugstore lip gloss these are glossier than the la girl you know the la girl lip paints these are glossier these are also full coverage great coverage gorgeous whatever but if you wanted to compete if there was any drugstore product that is comparable to the la girl glazed lip paints it would be the rimmel london show off lip lacquers although these are better quality than these because these are a little bit messier these have this kind of applicator so you know it makes it a little bit harder and um these are a little bit these are even glossier so these don't last as long as as, as the la girl lip paints do so there you have it ladies go out and get you some lip paints they're amazing they're great they're gorgeous they're everything you want in a lip gloss with the look of a lipstick in terms of without it being sheer you know full coverage highly pigmented um great 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 drugstore quality and i hope you enjoy these swatches for more swatches more detailed review hit up www.lisaalamo.com i'll have everything you need there thank you so so much for watching and subscribing and comment below with your thoughts about these swatches and this review okay thanks so much bye bye